What do you see from your vantage point that leads you to, to suggest that the crisis is not over yet? I think Dodd-Frank, in particular, the, the legislation that uh, was supposed to say it's all over, go home, nothing to see here, uh, has very much engaged with the banking system that we know about, the traditional banking system, and it's, it's made some uh, suggestions for reforming that and, 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 and tightening up but has not really engaged with the modern, with, with the shadow banking system, with the, which is where the, the shift of uh, our credit system from a bank lending system to a capital market system. This is the big thing that's, that's sort of happened uh, in, the, in the last several decades, and that requires an intellectual response that requires us now rethinking about the whole issue of regulation, the whole issue of monetary policy for that matter. Um, in this new in this new world, Dodd Frank hardly touches that that new world, and I think mostly because um, no one knew, no one gave them advice. You know, these are these are uh, congressmen um, making making policy, and that's what that's the task ahead of us to develop some intellectual framework where we could give some good advice about what sort of what sort of uh, uh, framework would be necessary in order to make this brave new world of capital market uh, credit system to make it work, to make it safe, to make it work for people, to make it work for economic development. Okay. Well, we're very glad you wrote the book and started us on that path to uh, understanding and rebuilding this system. As you've told me in private conversations over the months, uh, the securitization markets broke down and we went back and tried to fix the banking system. While they interact, people don't seem to have uh, you might call uh, a good grasp of the interconnection between securitization and banking or how shadow markets replicated a banking system and created what they used to call maturity transformation, borrow short, lend long, and created the same instabilities that deposit insurance were designed to, mm -hmm. uh, to eliminate. So when I look at uh, the new Lombard Street, I'm very grateful that you've set us on the road of uh, illuminating the structures, the fault lines, and the challenges that we uh, see in this modern mar money market. And if there's any chance to uh, diminish or avoid that next crisis, I'm sure you'll have contributed to it. Thanks very much. Thank you.